So grateful to have you with us here. Listen, we've got some breaking news we've got to get to right now. We are just getting word Brown's defensive end, Miles Garrett, has been in a car accident. This happened in Wadsworth Township. That's in Medina County. <laughs> Jim Donovan is here uh, with what we know. Jim, uh, I know that it's early. I know it's a very fluid situation, but do you have any indication how serious this is? Uh, we are learning that they, uh, both Miles Garrett and a companion, a female companion who was in the car with him, were involved in that car accident a little bit around 3 o'clock this afternoon or a little bit after 3 o'clock. They were traveling south on State Road, south on Route 18. Now, the car overturned. We do know that. Both Miles Garrett and his female companion, who was the passenger in the car, have injuries. They are non-life-threatening injuries. Both were alert. Both were taken from the accident site to a local hospital for examination. Both we have been determining and have determined from some of the facts coming our way, both were wearing their seatbelts. And I know this is a question that always comes into play when there's an accident like this. Was there any sign of alcohol, any sign of impairment, and a definitive no to both of those questions? No sign of impairment, no sign of alcohol. The investigation is clearly very early right now. Both, once again, were alert, the female companion and Miles Garrett. Now, the background on this, this makes sense at 3 o'clock in the afternoon. The Browns had practiced at about 11.15 this morning. So in the middle of the afternoon like that, they would have been done with a Monday's day's work and they would be off tomorrow and then start preparation for their next game coming up on Wednesday. They'll be in Atlanta this Sunday. Once again, Miles Garrett and a female companion involved in a car crash. They were traveling south on State Road, south on Route 18. The accident occurred at about 3 o'clock this afternoon. Both were injured. The injuries right now, non-life-threatening. Both were alert. Both have been taken to an area hospital to be examined. It was a gray Porsche, 2021 gray Porsche. That was the uh, vehicle that was involved. The vehicle did overturn. Those are the details we have right now. And Christy, as you said, it is a very fluid situation. No comment yet from the Browns. We have checked in with them. We are getting the comments and the information coming to us from the troopers involved that were at the accident site. And Jimmy, if I, I'm hearing you and I'm understanding this correctly, uh, there's no indication there was any other vehicle involved other than theirs, or we don't know yet. Absolutely. It looks as though um, that there was not another vehicle involved, that there may have been a high rate of speed, that uh, Miles Garrett might have lost control of the car uh, on the road at that particular time, but we are not hearing that there was another vehicle involved at all. The vehicle did overturn. There have been reports, reports that it overturned a couple of times, but at least uh, we can only confirm that it was overturned. We don't know the exact number. Okay, good to know. Jimmy, thank you so much. I know that uh, that's, like we said, fluid situation. We're going to continue to get information, and of course, as soon as we do, we will get it to you.